Your forecast first for tonight, mostly clear skies, 51 degrees for an overnight low for tomorrow. High temperature of 77, sunny skies, southwest winds at 5 to 10 miles per hour. We're back closer to the comfort zone after a warm week. Our high today was 77, 75 is average. No precipitation out at the airport, 851 our sunset time tonight. Right now it's 77 in Spokane. Breezy winds out of the southwest at 17 miles per hour with gusts to 28 miles per hour. Those winds are going to be dying down later this evening. A calmer day on the way for tomorrow. 75 right now in Coeur d'Alene with southwest winds at 9 and gusts to 18 miles per hour. We have a few isolated showers and thunderstorms right up along the Canadian border in extreme northeastern Washington and North Idaho. Those will be coming to an end later this evening. They're in association with a dry cold front that picked up our winds today, dropped our temperatures back down into the 70s after a week in the 80s, and we are going to see that moving off to the east, leaving us with a pleasant day tomorrow. The jet stream to our south, we are on the warm side, temperatures about average, if not a little bit above, with the hot weather to our south, and that is the way it is going to stay through the weekend and the first part of the work week, and then we start to see some changes. Overnight lows tonight will be down in the 40s and 50s with mostly clear skies. Tomorrow, Omak and Moses Lake will be in the lower to mid 80s with sunny skies. Beautiful day around Spokane and Coeur d'Alene. Lots of 70s on the map. 80 tomorrow in Cheney in the Northeast Mountains and North Idaho. Sunny skies will keep the thunderstorms away tomorrow. 80 in Colville. 76 tomorrow in Sandpoint in the 70s in Kellogg as well as Moscow and Pullman 84 tomorrow in Lewiston around the Northwest temperatures in the 70s and 80s throughout the entire region with dry conditions region wide. Here is your seven day forecast dry and calmer for the weekend summer starts on Sunday Father's Day Sunday early indications are we are going to kick off a warming trend the middle of next week those temperatures I've thrown up there may Maybe a little on the conservative side Ooh. heading into Thursday, Friday, and right now Hoop Fest weekend looks like it is going to be potentially in the 90s, and that is at the airport on the grass. Downtown Spokane could be Ooh. really toasty. So we've had some hot Hoop Fest. Yes, we have, and, and it is a game changer. It's challenging to say yes. the least for those playing <laughs> and even those watching. So we'll be following how if that tweaks or. It could too. So let's okay. hope. Yeah. Thanks, Chris.